Hi, I'm Danielle Valiente with Atmosphere Salon, and our topic is hair color do's and don'ts. Let's start with the do's. Do choose a color that suits your skin tone and eye color. Use Color Protect shampoo and conditioners and indulge in a deep conditioning treatment every so often to keep the health of the hair improved. And the final do is to go to a beauty school if you're on a budget. The price is drastically reduced, but it takes a little bit longer to have the color done, but it's done under the supervision of a licensed instructor. Let's talk about the don'ts. Don't take shortcuts. And if you're coloring your hair yourself at home, don't think and assume that the picture on the box of hair color is what you're gonna get because there's a lot of steps that go into formulating hair color. Don't color outside your lifestyle. And what I mean by that is if you have a job that requires you to look more conservative, choose colors that are a little bit more classic and professional looking. And the final don't is don't do it yourself if you can afford to go to a salon and have a professional do it for you. And those are the do's and don'ts of hair coloring. I'm Danielle Valiente with Atmosphere Salon. Thank you.